just finished testing the G3 uh, Angler V17SF, which stands for Sport Fish. It's powered by a Yamaha F150, and the combination of those two just turned this into a little sports car. We got on plane in 2.1 seconds. We had a fair amount of bow rise, but the bow came down almost immediately. And we got to 30 miles an hour in 6.5 seconds. And our top speed was 50.4 miles an hour. Let's go back to the dock and check out some of the features of this boat. Larry, one of the things that struck me about this boat is how wide it is for its length. It seems to have a whole lot of room. I see we have room for two pedestal chairs back here. Yeah, we've uh, changed a few things with uh, gunnels and stuff. We used the new uh, gunnels here to give us a little more beam inside to open it up for a little more room walking around in the boat. Yeah, they have a very large live well in here and got the bait bucket. This other compartment here is for the bait bucket over here. This is a large live well and one also in the front, a second one. Great. Uh, Larry, I'm not sure I've seen a G3 helm that looked exactly like this. Is this a new model this year? Yeah, this year this is a new one. We was trying a little bit different to give a little more room for the variety of graphs and stuff that everybody uses and to be able to see your gauges and stuff better with the tilt wheel and stuff. Switches are easy to operate toggles instead of the rockers and stuff and put a little bit larger glove box in this port side over here. Larry, all the fishermen I know have about a million rods. Uh, where are they going to store them on this boat? Actually, in this boat here, we've got a very large rock locker system. It's opened up so you can get quite a few rods. You can actually hang some mm -hmm. and then you can lay a lot in there loose. Your batteries store underneath the locker system when you raise it up to be able to get to your motor batteries and add a charger if you need to. Nice. You know, one thing I love about the front deck here, it looks like this boat kind of carried the beam pretty far forward, so you have an awful lot of room up here. Yes, we did do that on purpose to keep it as wide as we could on the front, just so that you could have the room and be able to get to your live well easy, your dry storage boxes, and uh, extra little compartments to stow stuff. Now you were telling me about the change that uh, G3 made with their uh, uh, storage lockers. What did, what did they do? We uh, use, uh, this one here has got a big plastic tub in it mm -hmm. too, with lips to, to shed the water away from it. Plus the latches that we put on this year, compression lock when you twist them, they actually suck the door down so it doesn't rattle and helps make a little bit better seal. Nice. For more information on the G3 Angler V17 SF and other great boats, go to BoatingWorld.com. I'm Alan Jones and we'll see you out on the water. Today's water, Table Rock Lake in Branson, Missouri. Beautiful fall day.